Hey, and welcome to a new video. Get ready to tackle fun challenges and test your skills. Let's get started. 10 times 3 equals what? Ten times three equals thirty. We have ten boxes, and each box has three colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have ten times three balls. This equals thirty balls. Three times one equals what? Three times one equals three. We have three boxes, and each box has one colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have three times one balls. This equals three balls. Seven times five equals what? Seven times five equals thirty-five. We have seven boxes, and each box has five colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have seven times five balls. This equals thirty-five balls. Four times six equals what? Four times six equals 24. We have four boxes, and each box has six colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have four times six balls. This equals 24 balls. Three times five equals what? Three times five equals 15. We have three boxes and each box has five colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have three times five balls. This equals 15 balls. Four times one equals what? Four times one equals four. We have four boxes, and each box has one colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have four times one balls. This equals four balls. Three times one equals what? Three times one equals three. We have three boxes, and each box has one colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have three times one balls. This equals three balls. Five times one equals what? Five times one equals five. We have five boxes, and each box has one colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have five times one balls. This equals five balls. Five times six equals what? Five times six equals 30. 
we have five boxes and each box has six colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have five times six balls. This equals 30 balls. Two times three equals what? Two times three equals six. We have two boxes, and each box has three colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have two times three balls. This equals six balls. Two times nine equals what? Two times nine equals 18. We have two boxes, and each box has nine colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have two times nine balls. This equals 18 balls. Six times four equals what? Six times four equals 24. We have six boxes, and each box has four colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have six times four balls. This equals 24 balls. Seven times nine equals what? Seven times nine equals 63. We have seven boxes, and each box has nine colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have seven times nine balls. This equals 63 balls. Ten times three equals what? Ten times three equals thirty. We have ten boxes, and each box has three colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have ten times three balls. This equals thirty balls. Nine times nine equals what? nine times nine equals 81. we have nine boxes and each box has nine colorful balls inside if you count all the balls in all the boxes together you will have nine times nine balls this equals 81 balls two times eight equals what Two times eight equals 16. We have two boxes and each box has eight colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have two times eight balls. This equals 16 balls. 10 times one equals what? 10 times 1 equals 10. We have 10 boxes, and each box has 1 colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have 10 times 1 balls. This equals 10 balls. 2 times 6 equals what? Two times 
6 equals 12. We have two boxes, and each box has six colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have 2 times 6 balls. This equals 12 balls. 4 times 9 equals what? Four times nine equals 36. We have four boxes and each box has nine colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have four times nine balls. This equals 36 balls. Eight times two equals what? Eight times two equals 16. We have eight boxes and each box has two colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have eight times two balls. This equals 16 balls.